Hey guys, Erwin Tech here. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be showing you the ultimate guide to Minecraft on your Chromebook. Before we start today's video, make sure to leave a like, subscribe to my channel, and turn on those post notifications so you get notified whenever I upload brand new videos to my channel. Another way of supporting me and my channel is you can buy my memberships. They're linked in the description below as always, or you can hit that little join button right next to the subscribe button and gain access to loads of monthly perks such as gifts, emojis, badges next to your name in live streams and comments. You can also get a secret members only Discord and secret members only live streams. That's all for now. Let's just get straight to the Alrighty guys, so before we start this tutorial, you'll need Linux mode enabled. I have a video linked in the description below if you want to go check that out on how to turn on Linux mode on your Chromebook. In short, you just hit the menu key, go to the search bar and type settings, hit enter, and then what you want to do is go to the bottom right here when it says Linux beta, click on that and click turn on. But if you want a more in-depth video, go to the one linked in the description below as always. After that, just close the settings. App. Then what you want to do is go to this website, which is linked in the description below. As always, you want to select computer and then you want to select Minecraft Java edition. And then after that, just wait for everything to load up. Hit buy Minecraft. We're not actually going to buy Minecraft. We're just going to get you a free account and then exit out of the whole process, which will give you a free Minecraft account. So if it asks you to sign in with your Microsoft account, just do so. Then after that, it will ask you to create your email. And then after you've created your email for your Minecraft account, now you have your Minecraft account. So what we just did there is hit buy Minecraft. And it's like, oh, you need to create an account. Then you create a brand new account. And then what you want to do after you create a brand new account is it brings you to this page to purchase Minecraft. But what you want to do is just exit out of it and not pay for Minecraft. So you can sign into Minecraft on your Chromebook with an account, but you didn't actually pay for it. See how I named myself eGamerGirl120? That's actually not my real username. I just created a brand new account for this video so I can get that free email to show you guys. After that, just close out of this then go to this website which will also be linked in the description below as always you want to scroll down to minecraft free trial select the little linux logo right there click on it then do debian and debian based distributions select that then hit download now Minecraft will download in the bottom right hand corner of your screen. Once it's done downloading, click show in folder. Once you've done clicking show in folder, this is the part where you actually have to have Linux mode enabled. So once you do have it enabled, double click on the file and install app with Linux beta will pop up. Then click install, hit OK and wait for it to be done installing on your Chromebook. Once it's done installing, you can hit the time and it'll say app is available on your terminal. There may also be an icon in your launcher. Once it says that, just close out of your files app just like that hit the menu key go up and find your Linux apps open it and click on the Minecraft launcher once Minecraft loads up you want to do Mojang login then what you want to do is enter in your email and your password we created a couple minutes ago and then hit login after you log into your account, Minecraft will pop up just like this. Then what you want to do is hit this little play button right here and Minecraft will start launching up on your Chromebook. Then once Minecraft launches up, it'll be a little screen, but you just hit this button right here to expand it. Then you can select single player and you can create your brand new world. Let's see, I'm going to name it YouTube video. Just name it like that make it a creative world and just create a new world and it's going to create your brand new minecraft world that you can play in so yeah let's just wait for the world to be done creating Alrighty, guys so now we are loaded in into the minecraft game it is a bit laggy but to reduce some lag just hit escape go to options click on that go to video settings then what you want to do clouds off make particles minimal turn entity shadows off Let's see, what else can we do? You can use, use V-Sync, turn that off. Smooth lighting, off. Graphics, you want to make them fast. If you just click on it, it's so laggy, but if you make the graphics fast, that will work. Then you make the max frame rate, like a little like low, like that. Render distance, real low. Then hit done, done, back to game. And you'll get a slightly, see? you'll get a slightly better performance. It's only a bit laggy because I am 
recording and oh look a desert temple and yeah now this is how you play minecraft on your chromebook but you're probably wondering how do i customize minecraft on our chromebook but that's what we're going to do next what you want to do is just hit escape save and quit the title and just quit your world and everything and you want to exit the game just hit quit game it'll quit and then what you want to do is go to this google doc which will be linked in the description below as always then what you want to do is open the terminal by hitting the menu key then type terminal hit enter and then you want to copy and paste the first command highlight it right click click copy, go back to your terminal, right click, and then it'll just automatically install the items that will be needed to install Badline Client on your Chromebook. But if you don't already know what Badline Client is, it lets you customize your Minecraft experience to the fullest, every single detail, you can customize it. Just do the second command, highlight it, right click, click copy, go back to your terminal, right click, hit enter, and wait for that to be done installing everything. After that, do the number three command, highlight it, right click, click copy go back to your terminal right click hit enter then what you want to do is hit y then what you want to do is hit y on your keyboard then hit enter and then it'll start installing but since i already have it on my chromebook i don't need to install it then do the number four command highlight it right click click copy go back to your terminal right click hit enter and there should do nothing just like that then do the number five command highlight it right click click copy, go back to your terminal, right click, and then it will automatically do license accepted and Badline Client will launch up on your Chromebook. After the installation, Badline Client will launch up on your Chromebook. What you want to do is just register your Badline account, then log in and you can play Badline Client on your Chromebook. Badline Client is a version of Minecraft that lets you customize the entire Minecraft experience to your liking. So yeah, guys, I really hope you enjoyed this ultimate guide to Minecraft on your Chromebook. Now enjoy. Thank you all for watching. Make sure to leave a like, subscribe to my channel, and turn on those post notifications so you get notified whenever I upload brand new videos to my channel. Another way of supporting me and my channel is if you buy my memberships. They're linked in the description below. As always, you can hit the little join button right next to the subscribe button and gain access to loads of monthly perks that I featured in the beginning of the video. If you want to go back and check those out, that would be greatly appreciated. And yeah, also another perk to subscribing to my channel is you can comment down below i subscribed and i'll give you a shout out in my next video so here are those people who commented down below i subscribed go subscribe to their channel search them up on youtube and show them some support that's all for now and i'll see you all next time bye